we made it time to come back. We, 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 we went to the decision to say, all right, let's let's get to hitting the road and let's get get locked in. I'm so just in a bad place and I wasn't happy, you know. And I, I my, my one of my closest friends here somewhere, he put on a church service and it was uh, the pastor was saying, hey, people keep praying for blessings and expecting to fall in their lap, but you gotta prepare yourself for it first. Um, you can't just just ask for handouts. You gotta do your part too. And um, I put it on and it stuck with me. I, I prayed. I prayed a lot. And uh, I actually started training not to fight again, but I was bad at helping. I was run the first week back to and uh, I made it 0.35 miles, and it took me five minutes and 12 seconds to do that. And to put that in perspective, the year after I finished high school, I ran a 439 miles. So uh, that sucked. And, I mean, and then all that's happening while I wait for the Tyson Fury, um, it just sucked. I was going to try to break top 15 in the world by the Two of the sanctioned body, 16 by another one. Um, I thought for the free title. You know what I mean? It just it sucked to see how fast I, I fell at such a young age. I'm 28 years old. I felt like I was like kind of done. I mean, I, I'll be honest with you, I started to give up. You know, I, I started to ask myself, you know, maybe this is what I'm going to do. You know, maybe, maybe I'll just be on the other side of the ropes. You know, I over my gym. You know, maybe that'll be it, but I wasn't happy. So I knew I had to make a change. And I'll be honest, I swear to God, I started training. Um, just because I was fucking uh, unhealthy. I'd get tired of going up the steps, bringing it with you. And for me, it sucked. You know what I mean? But I feel great now. Did you uh, have to address your mental health right now? I did. I tried a lot. You know what I mean? And, and I'm, not, you know, I'm not knocking anything. I try to go to therapists. They try to bring me medicine. And I said, no. He diagnosed me with uh, moderate to severe depression. So, um, that, that was a God. I, I, I went to God and I, I was trained my relationship with God and I trained and I got healthy and I did my part um, outside of this plan. I did my part. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what did it for me. And again, I got give a lot of credit to this woman that got brought to my life and really, she, 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 she did everything. So how long do you want to, you know, you said you're 28 and you're getting back into the ring. Uh, how far do you want to take it? Is this just like a one fight, year to year fight? Or? No, 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 this is, this is, I'm, I'm going, I'm making a real run, you know. Although I've, I've been ranked in the top, you know, 15 or two, I've, I've, I've done good, but I can't say that I've given it a full honest try because now that I'm older, I know more that I didn't know. I know more about the business. I know more about training. I know that. So even though I did a great run before, it wasn't my, the best run that I could make. Now I know all that. I'm going to get back in shape and I'm going to give it a real, a real run. And um, I see, again, there's never, I don't have a bone to hate Amy, but I see fighters that I know that I can either do what they're doing or do better than them. have success and it motivates me to, to want to do better. You know? So what weight, what weight do you want to campaign that? I, I, so this first fight is at a catch weight above, uh, like it's 185. I don't want to kill myself. It's got nothing to it. Hopefully, in January 21st, I'll fight at 168, which will be super middleweight. And I'm going to decide if I'm going to campaign there or go down to 160. I just, it's been a while since I've made the weight, and I, I don't know how my, I don't know how I feel. You know I mean, I, I blew up to 270 pounds. So I, to think that I'm a, hey, you're going to fight 110 pounds less just a year, less than a year later, that sounds crazy. But, you know, I'm, I'm 60 something pounds down. So it's doable, but I just want to see how I feel. Uh, you want to leave a message for your supporters? I just appreciate it. It's been, it's been crazy. I actually thought a lot of people would be hesitant. You know, I've had a couple of comebacks and failed. It's been a long time. A lot of people would be hesitant, but I, I've got requested for more ringside seats than we even have now. Um, I ain't a cheap ticket. I just feel support from the, the city. You know, nobody, nobody hesitated in, in support. I mean, I, that's always been the driving point of my career, so I, just gotta, I appreciate that a lot. All right, Dusty Harrison.